Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover the prime factorization of 88. So we are breaking 88 down into its prime factors, the prime numbers that multiply to equal 88. So looking at 88, we need to start breaking this down by thinking of two factors, two numbers that multiply to give us 88. Well, 8 and 11 are factors of 88. 8 times 11 equals 88. So let's break this down into 8 and 11. Now keep in mind, there are other factors we could have started with here. For example, 4 and 22, or 2 and 44. And those other options will work as well. Depending on the number, there can be multiple different factors that we can use. So there can be multiple ways we can do these. But in the end, we will get to the same prime numbers. And that's what's important. Now let's continue to break this down. So we have 8 and 11. Now 11 is a prime number. So we are done here. We can't break that down any further. So let's circle 11 to show that we have a prime number. Now eight, we can break down further. So we need to think of factors here. Well, two and four are factors of eight. So let's break eight down into two and four. Now two is a prime number. So we are done here, but we can break four down further. So we need to think of factors of four. Well, we know two times two is four. Two is a factor of four. So let's break four down into two and two. Again, two is a prime number. So we are done here and here. And that's the prime factorization of 88. We don't have anything else that we can break down any further. We have all prime numbers. So let's write this out as 88 equals, and then we can write our prime factors in order from least to greatest here, and we are multiplying them. We have 2 times 2 times 2 times 11. If we have the correct prime numbers, they will multiply to equal our original number. So let's check. 2 times 2 is 4, times 2 is 8, times 11 is 88, so we are correct here. So there you have it. There's the prime factorization of 88. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.